such a dish right here. And the theme for today's video is something a little bit different. I've been thinking a lot about different ways of storytelling and I had this idea. This community spans oceans and you are all so creative and have done so many awesome things with me in my other videos. I thought, let's do something bigger. There are a lot of things out there that are truly universal. And so for this, I picked a topic that I thought would be fun to start out with and was quite fitting for this channel. The theme is instant noodles. I asked all of you to film your favorite instant noodle dish and share it with me, and together we would make one big video. So this video is made by us for us. <laughs> and I think that we should do this again. At the end of this video, I will let you all know the theme for the next one and how to participate if you wanna be a part of it. But for now, grab a snack, sit down, and let's all share a meal together. The global instant noodle market is worth around $50 billion a year. And according to the World Instant Noodle Association, and yes, that is a thing, over 106 billion servings are consumed every year worldwide. <laughs> And that's obviously not all through one company. There are tons of instant noodle brands depending on where you live, but the original instant noodle was made in Japan. On August 25th, 1958, Nissan Foods released Chicken Ramen. It was created by the company's founder, Momofuku Ando. By the way, he was 48 years old at the time. So that's just to say, you know, don't think you have to have it all figured out in your 20s. <laughs> The release of these noodles was actually a reaction to World War II. Ando wanted to find a cheap and effective way to distribute food to people in Japan. From there, the market expanded outside of Japan. It went global. Before we start cooking, we need to pick a packet, right? So I have here is my basket of instant noodles. The gin ramen. I think this is the one for the night. Ramen. Pinning white curry noodle. Maggi. Shin ramen. A curry ramen. Classic ramen. Yum yum. Indomie instant noodles. Lucky me instant pancit canton. Samyang noodles. Mi goreng ace. Indomie soto mi. I found from the market yesterday. This flavor is with mushrooms. Why buy instant noodles? I've never tried this brand or type before, but we're gonna give it a shot. I also wanna add this before we get into the next section. In researching for this video, I ended up watching a ton of instant noodle ads and um, they're pretty wild. So you should also watch them. Fried noodles. Oriental. So delicious. Oriental. Yup to the cup, fantastic. Yup to the cup. Yup to the cup. Yup to the cup, fantastic. <laughs> Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> it's so good. It is so good. So according to this graph, and you might remember it from the spicy Indomie video. I love this graph. Global demand for instant noodles is outlined as such. In order of demand, we've got China, Indonesia, India, Japan, Vietnam, and the United States in the top six. So in the ask for this video, I wanted to know, where are you from? Welcome to Borneo Island, Indonesia. This is my hometown. I'm in Liverpool, England today. It's very sunny and nice weather. Hi, I'm Ruth and I'm from New York. Hello, my name is Edward Landeros and I am from Southern California. Hello world, my name is Princess and I'm from the Philippines. Hi, I'm Faith, I'm from London, I'm British Chinese. My name is Suman and I live in Chandrapur, India. Hi everyone. Uh, my name is Pedro, I'm from Minas Gerais, Brazil. Hi Pedro, my name is Alisher, I'm from Nusultan, Kazakhstan. Hey 
everyone， 大家好，我叫吴婷，我是一个大学生。Hello， I am Ruby Wu， and I am a college student right now， which means that ramen is a staple。Namaste， I am Surbi Mahajan， I am from Delhi， India。I'm Kat， and I'm from the Philippines。Hello， my name is Nicholas， and hi， I'm Rowan， and we both live in Lille in the north of France。สวัสดีครับทุกทุกคน My name is Ben I'm Thai American and I live in Boulder Colorado Hi I'm Afisa from Indonesia I'm Abdul Jawad I'm from Balochistan Pakistan I am originally from Kuala Lumpur Malaysia I am currently here in the United States in Northeast Iowa Hi I'm Deva Priya from Toronto Canada I'm Madhvi I'm from New Delhi India Hi, I'm Eva. I'm from Indonesia. So this is the view from my house in Batu Jajar, Bandung, Indonesia. Hi, I'm Wini. I am a first-generation Chinese born in Suriname, and I'm currently residing in the Netherlands. Finally, we're at the best part. Let's make them. So to actually start making the、uh, bowl of ramen, all we're gonna do is we're gonna add all the noodles in there. Nothing special. To get it started, of course, we are going to boil our noodles. Chopped up some carrot as well as some green beans. Half cooked noodles and half cooked shrimps. Chopped leeks, celery, and garlic. I'm using enoki mushrooms in my noodles. Frozen peas, corns. Add some meat or other vegetables to substitute. Today I'm going to put deep fried spring rolls. Put the filling inside the tofu bowl. Fry them. So what you do is take the wire wire packet, crush it, pour it in a bowl. Add some chopped onions, tomatoes. I also like to add some green chilies because I like them very spicy. We just added the creamer. I put five because I chili in this dish. Kimchi. It's time to crack some eggs. Fried eggs. Poached eggs. We're gonna poach this egg. Eggs. I will break an egg on top of it. As you can see, we just added the fancy ingredients. We just added our egg. So this is the bread that generally a lot of Filipinos eat. They're eaten along with the noodles. So that's how we would eat pancit canton. So as we say in Filipino, kaina. It's time for everybody to sit down and show off. Their final meals. I have Maggie noodles with mushrooms, kimchi, and cheese. Today we're gonna eat a ramen dish inspired by Welsh rabbits, with some Filipino touches such as the fried egg, more liquid seasoning, and my favorite Indonesian chili sambal sauce. Bon appetit! Bon appetit! I add one poached egg and some crackers, and if you see like sprinkles on the top of the noodles, that is. Fried shallot, or Indonesian people call it a bonggoreng. I am eating a street taco ramen. This is tofu filled with shrimp and noodles. Which is maggi with onions and a poached egg. Tada! I added some shrimps for a complete meal and Chinese cabbage. Bacon, cheese, eggs. And broccoli and carrot. These are noodles. It's me. So these are my noodles. Just finished making them. So I have some meat and some spring onions,、uh, plus another failed attempt at a boiled egg. Fried eggs, sausages, cheese, mayonnaise, and kimchi. I love this meal. Boom. Boom! I'm eating potato ramen <laughs> for breakfast. <laughs> Bad idea, but it's okay. I think it's it's fine. Yes, it is the morning. I'm having instant noodles, and I'm having Thai-inspired peanut sauce 
instant noodles. These are the Cheng's hot garlic noodles with extra garlic added, extra soy sauce added and some cheese, amul cheese. This just hits the right spot. All right, everyone, let's eat. <laughs> First bite together, everyone. Cheers. Cheers. Jumakan. Who made that? I made that. <laughs> It's really, really spicy. It's delicious this time. I couldn't stop. I'm sorry. This is my second time having it. I really like it. Try it! To wax poetic about instant noodles. Happy food dance. <laughs> mm. It's really good. It is the ultimate comfort food. It is, mm, that is so good. an embrace of safety, like a blanket. Pretty good. Comfort food is something else, isn't it? <laughs> it gives you something tangible, like you're eating something that you made. Amazing. Yeah, here's my, here's my instant noodles. Thank you for putting all of us together and enjoying this meal together. It's gonna make me feel like I'm eating with a whole bunch of people rather than being stuck at home. Cheers to this virtual dinner with Beryl and everyone. It just warms my heart. I love, loved making this and I loved feeling like we were all kind of in this together. I don't know, I just, I feel like I smiled the whole time I was editing. A huge, huge thank you to everybody who participated. I actually did a little something special, so if you look in the description, I put everybody's recipes, who sent them to me, in a big, fun, little brochure, cookbook type thing, so that if you wanna recreate them yourself, they're all here, below, down there. So, I've kind of changed my mind since the beginning of the video. I decided instead, I think that you guys should actually pick the theme. So leave a comment with what you would love to see for the next video like this. And everybody kind of go through and upvote your favorite ideas. The top three ideas with the most votes will go to the community page and we will then narrow it down to the final winner. And just for fun, because I love you guys, whoever comes up with the winning theme will get a prize from me. So. Leave your comments and let's do this again. Okay, with that, I will see you all in my next video. <laughs>